What's going on everybody? This is your host Manik back with yet another video. And this time it is something that quite a few asked me for. That is how we can enable ECG and BP monitoring on the Galaxy Watch 4. And in all honesty, this is one of the best watches under 10k if you're willing to buy a proper smartwatch in 2022. It has most of the features that a normal user would like in practical life. And due to regulations, they have disabled the blood pressure and ECG feature in India which is actually a really good thing have on a device of this size. But don't consider it as a medical grade equipment. Alright, so without wasting a second, let's see how you can enable these in India or any other country as well. And before we get into all that, make sure to press the subscribe button and in case you wish to watch this video in Hindi language, here is a card to the BitTech Hindi channel. Now the process is very simple, you just need a few things before we can start. First up, you have to download some files and an application and links to all of these are just below the like button. So first of all, download the bug Jager APK from the Play Store. After that, download the modded Samsung Health app for watch as well as for your mobile. So both of these are attached in the description area as well. And now we can start off with the process. Alright, so first of all, you have to enable ADB over Wi-Fi in your Galaxy Watch 4. And this is basically to transfer the application from phone to watch without PC. To do that, you have to enable developer options on your watch. So go to settings, go to about watch and now go to the software info option. Here tap on the software version 8 times and you can see this will enable developer options on your watch. Now go back and you will see developer options are enabled. So tap on it and make sure your watch and phone are connected to the same Wi-Fi. Now turn on this debug over Wi-Fi option and it will show you an address and the last four numbers are the port number. After this open that bug Jager application that you installed and here click on this plus button. As you can see there are no devices connected right now. So you have to enter the address that we got in the first step here. Like mine is 192.168 and as you can see. So the port number are the last four digits of the address and for me it is like 5555. Now click on this connect button after entering the details and this will ask your watch to connect in ADB mode to transfer those files we talked about earlier. Choose always allow this PC on your watch and you will be good to go forever. It will now show as connected. After this click on the third tab called packages and here you basically have to choose the watch for Samsung health app. Now click on the plus button above, select the first option, click on ok and choose the watch shm.apk file and this will start installing this application on your Galaxy Watch 4 as simple as that. Now you will be able to see this Samsung Health Monitor application on your Watch 4. Once this app is installed, open the file manager on your phone, install the Samsung Health Monitor app on your Android phone. And after this, just set up the application, make your profile fill all the details and there you go. You have now enabled ECG and BP monitoring on your Galaxy Watch 4. And it works just fine, but for blood pressure monitoring you need a BP machine as well, as it needs calibration and only then it will be accurate. Other than that, the ECG feature works just fine and you can even share this report as a PDF, which is quite helpful. So yes, this was a quick way to enable ECG and BP monitoring on your Galaxy Watch 4. And if you end up liking this video, make sure to press that like button and tap on that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one.